Hi, this is a video for assignment 1 for Harvard's game development course. I'll begin by showing the original game made in the lecture and then move on to showing the features I have added. The game starts with the title screen and background music. The user can press space or use the left mouse button to make the bird jump. If the bird collides with a pipe, the game ends and the score gets displayed. The assignment has four main objectives, which I'll walk you through one by one. I've also fixed a glitch that was present in the original game, and I've also added a new feature that I guess the title gave away. I randomized the gap between the pipes by adding this line of code that randomizes the gap length, and by adding that as a parameter to the pipe constructor. The gap between two pipe pairs was randomized by adding a variable called extra time. When a pair is created, the time delay for the next one is decided randomly, thus effectively changing the distance between them. The player upon scoring a certain number of points is rewarded with a message and a trophy. I set the minimum threshold as 10 points for a bronze trophy, 25 for silver and 50 for a gold on one. The last objective was to implement a pause feature, which pauses music and all the action on the screen. I did this by adding a state to the state machine called the pause state. Upon pressing enter, the game goes from the play state to the pause state and vice versa. The variables from the previous state are introduced as parameters into the new state, so that all of the information like the position of the bird and the pipes can be retained even after when the game is unpaused. In the original build, the player can jump really high and pass over the pipes, which theoretically means they can't lose. This was fixed by limiting the movement of the player vertically. I added the feature of health to the game. This takes away the punishing charm of the original, but gives the player more chances to make a mistake. The player incurs damage as long as they are touching the pipes, thus the extent of their mistimed jump is penalized accordingly. That's it for assignment 1. The link to the code is in the description below. This time, I've also uploaded the .exe file if you want to try the game out. See you next time. Bye!